What's up everyone? My name is Sebs and we're about to enter round two of the Revenge of Shinobi. So without any further ado, let's just get into the action. Now, round two starts us off at a little bit of a waterfall level, so uh, I'm gonna try to get through it without losing too many lives here. And this level actually introduces a new kind of enemy, which is kind of weird looking. It's a ninja sitting on top of bat wings. Basically, bat wings. I, I don't know what to say about it, but it's a new enemy, so um, we're gonna see a lot of him, at least in this level. Okay, I'm guessing we need to jump on the log right there. Um, ooh, no, I'm, I'm saying that's way too far down. You guys know what? I'm gonna show you a new jitsu. The jitsu is the fushin. We're gonna try this one right now. So, ninjutsu time. Let's see. Hiya. And now I'm gonna be able to jump a lot higher. There we go. Whoa, yes. Now, this ability is freaking sweet. Let's see, can I draw? No, I can't. Let's just do it like this. There we go. And we got some more of those. That's awesome. Always welcome. <coughs> Holy shit, that's a bomb. Let's wait until it explodes. Got both of those and a little bit of a refill right there. Holy shit, it's a Batman. Oh, fuck! Oh, he took my pow, that son of a bitch. Okay, so we're approaching the end of the first level of stage two. Come on! Yes, I actually did it. Whew. So, we're entering stage two of round two. And I don't know what town or whatever this is that is located like right next to a waterfall, but I'm, I'm not gonna complain. That's a bomb. I'm, I'm not gonna stand around for that one to explode. I'm just gonna move on. We got a little bit of a refill right there for our throwing weapons. I do like that. Ooh, fuck me. Oh, that's bullshit. That is bullshit. But him dying is not bullshit. Okay, there's a bomb and there's some a uh, big refill, so I'm gonna wait and get that. Thank you, and you die. Thank you. Huh? Oh, nice, I got up. And a little bit of a refill right there. Okay, I see nothing, so I'm, I'm dropping down. Let's try this one. Nice, that's a pow. Oh shit! Oh, I lost my pow. That's unfortunate. Maybe a new one? No, just a small refill. So I'm, I'm actually thinking like they, they look way too casual to be a part of this Neo Seed uh, trio, uh, well not trio, the Neo Seed gang. They, they look way too casually dressed to be part of a, like an evil crime organization. I'm guessing they're. They're out here and trying to stop me because I look a little bit evil because ninjas and shit. <coughs> Alright. Can this guy calm down? I mean, holy shit. Okay. Alright, we've reached the exit and that sign right outside the place we're entering actually looks like uh, a little bit like a sign outside of a stripper place. Not that I would know. Um, let's enter this place. So, <laughs> the boss in uh, this round is, uh, I actually don't know its name, I just call him the Disco Ninja. Uh, basically what you do is you need to stand underneath him, wait for him to drop down and kick the shit out of him, and try not to take too much damage. Ouch, ouch. And if you do take too much damage, you can use the uh, one of the abilities, one of the ninjutsus, but I can't right now. Fuck, I died. I can't right now because I already used it in the previous fucking level. That's unfortunate. But now we can do it again. Ugh, let's do this. Ah, oh, he hit me. Move. And kick, 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 kick. 
Now, a good thing about sitting and kicking like this is if you're lucky, you're actually blocking his projectiles, and uh, that is always a good thing. Son of a ball sack. Come on. There we go. Get hit. Yes! Yes! I got him. Oh, thank you. Round two is now cleared, and I actually got a little bit of a technical bonus right there. Cool. So I will see you all next time for round three. Peace out.